Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you step by step how to install the Immersive Portals mod for Minecraft 1.16.5. Just a heads up, this will only work for the Java edition of the game and not the Bedrock edition. Aside from that, let's get right into it. Alright, let's get into it. Let's close that out. Alright, now we are on our desktop. You want to go out to the internet. Edge, Firefox, Chrome, whatever you have, it doesn't matter. You want to search up Immersive Portals Mod. You want to click the CurseForge link and also open up files.minecraftforge.net. Links will be down below if you need them. You want to go to Files and you want to download 1.16.5 here. I already have it, so once you're done with that, you want to go over to Minecraft Forge, the site right here for Minecraft Forge downloads. For here, you want to click the latest. Alright, don't click anything on here because nothing on this page is safe, believe me. Alright, you want to skip, and Forge will download. Alright, you want to keep the file because the file is not malicious. Alright, once that's done, you want to go to your downloads folder. You want to take both files and drag them to your desktop. Now what you want to do is go to your Minecraft launcher. Alright, once you're in your Minecraft launcher, you want to run normal Minecraft 1.16.5. I've already run it, so there's no need for me to do it again. You want to run normal Minecraft 1.16.5, and once it's up, you want to hit Quit Game. So again, run normal Minecraft 1.16.5 and hit Quit Game immediately once it's up. After that's done, close out your launcher, hit Windows R, navigate to percent app data percent, hit OK. You want to go to dot Minecraft mods and you're going to need a mods folder for this so just create one and name it mods throw your immersive portals mod in here and close that out you want to run forge let's run it again all right once it's up i already have it so i don't really need to do this again but you want to hit install client and hit ok it'll let you know once it's done so, we're just going to throw that away. Alright, run your Minecraft launcher. It'll let you know when your forge is done. And you do have to run the normal versions first. Like, you run normal Minecraft 1.16.5 before you run forge. I've got a lot of complaints on that, on why forge isn't working, and that's why. Alright, once you open your Minecraft launcher, you'll see forge right here. It'll kind of look differently. For you because you first got it and I kind of customized mine but you'll see Minecraft Forge 1.16.5 here the text if you don't click installations new installation and it should be somewhere on this list and you can you know edit from there all right so once you have it and you have your icon and the amount of RAM you have all that good stuff selected you want to run Minecraft Forge and I'll see you when it's up you just gotta wait I also apologize for the delay of videos. Um, I lost my uh, expensive pair of gaming headphones and I had to kind of use a spare one in the meantime. But uh, I think I should be back on track now. Drag this up here. Okay. 
All right, I got a big program in the background, so I'm going to restart my Minecraft. I don't know what's up with that. It normally doesn't do that. I got uh, Filmora and OBS and all that running in the background, so that's probably why. Let's rerun this. There we go. You can fast forward the video ahead if you'd like. Finally. Alright, once you're on your Minecraft, you want to load up a world. I'll just do a super flat world, for example. Alright, once you're on your world, um, I should probably put it in full screen because my thing runs better in full screen. But um, it doesn't matter. Um, you want to go in your inventory, go here, search items, scroll all the way down. You will see a portal helper and you're going to need flint and steel. If you guys want a video on how this works, you can um, just tell me and I'll uh, show you a video. Or you could watch another tutorial from a different YouTuber. Other than that, that's how to install the Immersive Portals mod, and um, I hope you learned something from that, and uh, Trigon's Lie Out. Easy go.